good. What's good with y'all, Aga family? I know you guys are probably waiting on my response. I'm inside the hotel with Ty the guy. You know what I'm saying? In flight reaction. FTC. You know but yeah, man, it's the next. Choked out reacts. Choked out reacts, man. You know what I'm saying? We over here in the building, man. We chilling inside the hotel. It's the next day after the bullshit happened with Chris Sales, bitch ass. Basically, what had happened was I got the footage of everything. Chris Sales, a glass, walked inside the club. You know what I'm saying? Uh, flight had said, yo, he's right there. I start recording. And I started saying, hey, Chris, I already got all the footage, man. This is going to explain everything. <laughs> y'all niggas is like oh mcqueen you ran away woo -doo -woo. Nigga, i didn't run away man as soon as flight got choked out you know what i'm saying niggas was expecting me to just run and flee the scene like some scary little nah nigga i was still standing there right here in this footage looking at chris still recording and his little short ass mexican midget nigga was trying to fucking slap the camera on him and i got the footage of that too right here <laughs> Just got kicked out of the club right now, bro. That shit crazy. But Chris Sales over here is still going crazy. And then after that, you know what I'm saying? The motherfucking everybody in the club was looking at Chris like, what the fuck is this nigga snapping for? And I'm sitting there getting my footage, having fun, being me. You already know Uncle Family how I get down, man. I'm just in, in there to get all the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? If Chris wanted to fight, we was gonna fight right there. You know what I'm saying? Nigga kept trying to say, let's go outside and motherfucking fight, nigga. We was gonna fight. If you was really about to shit, we was right there. We was looking right at you in your fucking eyes, Chris. So I was chilling right there, chilling, getting my footage, you know what I'm saying, relaxing, having fun. And then all security and the cops came in, you know what I'm saying, and told me to go upstairs because they didn't want me to be around a motherfucking scene. <laughs> wasn't just finna nigga i would have walked out if i wanted to nigga but i was in there getting my footage because i wanted to get all the entertainment for us like a family you know what i'm saying and that's exactly what i did so i know you guys enjoyed the footage man this shit was funny and lit as hell i was in there chilling having fun if chris was gonna swing we was gonna scrap right then and there but he didn't so because probably because he didn't really want to fucking fight and, you know parker was in there how you doing parker you know what i'm saying you were looking good last night baby we were looking right at you too man i thought you guys wasn't dating no more but it's all good man you know what I'm saying? we was <laughs> We was in there chilling, man, having fun, doing our thing. There's really nothing that I'm not gonna get up on here and start talking crazy like as if, you know, like I'm some internet thug, because, you know, Chris Sale, you know, he's a professional internet thug. That's really what we all, man. That's it. That's, that's the end of the story. Uh, it was good times. I had I had a great time. I got some great footage for us, man. And uh, I can't wait to see him again. <laughs> Can I interrupt you right quick? Go ahead. Are you motherfucker creeping in that motherfucker? Nigga, I was motherfucker creeping inside that motherfucking club, nigga. Is Chris Sales know you a fucker crooked? I think from last night, he knows I'm a motherfucker crap, nigga. For real? I think, honestly, Chris Sales is like the, the ultimate YouTuber, my nigga. I think Chris Sales is like the top YouTuber in the game right now. For real? Would you agree? He ain't a motherfucker crip! So I can't agree. I think that as a motherfucker crip, I gotta give this nigga credit. You know what I'm saying? Because, Chris, you are literally the most entertaining, talented YouTuber I've ever met in my time. And I honestly can't wait to see you again so I can get your, your autograph in person again. Nigga, like, I don't know why you was getting so mad, nigga. I was trying to get it right there. You know what I'm saying? But you was just trying to snap in front of Parker. You know what I'm saying? Yo, niggas. Just and your little, uh, little, your little uh, Mexican Oompa Loompa friend too, you know what I'm saying? That nigga was going crazy. That Oompa Loompa nigga, that was the funniest shit ever. <laughs> that was the funniest shit ever, dude. What you got to say about the Oompa Loompa nigga, motherfucker, crap? Nigga, 
you need to do something. You need to wear some fucking heels or something. Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga was shorter than a motherfucker. That nigga you know needed man? some stilts. He needed some. <laughs> That's the shortest nigga I ever seen in my life, nigga. That nigga M- mind you, nigga, you you right here, nigga, nigga go like this. To- <laughs> I hate short niggas that try to act hard as fuck. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, bitch, you fucking small. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like, don't try to act fucking tough and you short as fuck. Yeah. You know I mean, saying? no disrespect to short niggas. Yeah. But that motherfucker, he's an oompa loompa. Yeah. Nah, that shit was funny as hell, though, man. We was in there. Chris, you already know what time it is, what nigga. If you wanted to fight, you would have fought us right there, man. Stop stop trying to get up on the internet and make yourself look hard and tough, nigga. Because we was right there looking at you right in your fucking eyes, nigga. You know what I'm saying? You wasn't trying to scratch. But you know what I'm saying? McQueen got that footage and we making money off the shit. So thank you, Chris Sales. You know what I'm saying? You just became a meme on the Aqua Family channel. Do you think that uh, the energy would have been different if he didn't, if he was a seven deep? Oh, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? The nigga was seven deep. You know what I'm saying? He was. He knew that the security guards was going to fucking have his back and push, or not have his back, push him off. He knew people was going, you know what I'm saying, trying to separate from the fight. That's mm-hmm. the only reason why he did this shit, nigga. And then he called flight, talking about, oh, I'm not finna argue with you. Blah, blah, blah. This is some woman shit. Like, nigga, well, you I, called I, us. I've never you... seen someone blow up my phone more than a female or any of my exes past 12 o'clock. Yeah, I was right. actually kind of fucking, like, scared of his, his, um... What is that thing called? A gender thing? Yeah. A straighter, uh... <laughs> bro, I think I saw... Nigga, I saw Parker staring at you, too, bro. Bro, dead Nigga, ass, she bro. literally was, like, choosing over you, bro. When we was inside the club, man, like, she was literally looking at you like, damn, bro, Chris is like, this nigga is so lame. I want to go fuck a flight, bro. Bro, I yeah. damn near felt bad. I could see it all in her face. Yeah. Like, hey, Parker, it's never too late, baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, look, man. Par- Parker, like, you know, we saw how you was feeling, man. Like, we saw... I saw you. We was inside a club and you was looking at Chris like, bro, I can't believe I'm with this nigga still. And you looked at Flight up and down, man. Look at him. You know what I'm saying? You can come get some FTC flavor if you want it. You know what I'm saying? Like, was she feeling your motherfucker vibe? She was feeling the vibe. Because I'm a motherfucker crib. You is a motherfucker crib. But yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? Parker, look, girl. Like, I, I know you don't want to fuck with that nigga no more, man. Um... I understand that his voice, as the day goes by, it's deteriorating even more, and you're getting tired of it, you know what I'm saying? As so- sooner or later, you're just gonna be talking to, to a mind. But, you know what I'm saying? FTC's voice is fully vocal, you know what I'm saying? Ah! You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? The kid can talk normal. The kid All can good. talk normal. Can eat normal, you know, you know what I'm saying? Whatsoever, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nobody passed out, called the Uber <laughs> as soon as I got fucking kicked off the premises of the club. Yeah. Waited for Queen for 10 minutes, and then we were out laughing about this issue. Yeah. But yeah, man, the security guard would not let me come downstairs, you know what I'm saying? As much as I really wanted to walk through, you know what I'm saying, and, and just leave the club. I, first of all, I wasn't going to leave because niggas was not scared of no fucking Chris Sales and any of his homies. And third of all, I wouldn't, they wouldn't even let me, you know what I'm saying? The cops came in, said, McQueen, you got to go upstairs. And the girls we was with, they already like knew, they like they was hosting the club, you know what I'm saying? So everyone was looking at them like, oh, you know what I'm saying, y'all got to get your homies and take them upstairs, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> And then we had to leave from up from upstairs because there was like a down exit, you know what I'm saying, side thing. So, nigga, nobody was running away from you, you know what I'm saying? No one was running at all. Uh, I had the footage. I was clearly standing there after fucking flight got kicked out. So, niggas was not afraid. Niggas was not going nowhere. I was standing my ground recording my shit, getting our footage for us, our family. That's it. So, yeah, man. With that being said, I love you guys with absolutely all of my heart. Make sure you subscribe, nigga, because I already told y'all that McQueen's gonna get all the lit ass footage for us during the summer. And I feel like I have been delivering. Because I'm a real motherfucking crib. Do you agree, motherfucking Ty? You've been motherfucker delivering and you've been motherfucker doing your motherfucker thing. Like a real motherfucker crib. I might just have to promote you to fuck a general of the fucker cribs. I'm gonna say it. I need my motherfucking crib general bag. Oh, let me go ahead and get it for you. Hold on. Don't show him where it's at. I'm gonna say it. I got my motherfucking real crepe general motherfucking badge now. Now you go, fucker. General fucker McQueen fucker crepe fucker. I'm <laughs> <laughs> you gotta emphasize. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Make sure you guys subscribe, man. Just join the fucking Aquafan, man, because you guys see how it turned we get the fuck over here, man. Join this shit. It's turned up. Like the video, man. Subscribe. You know what I'm saying? New videos, new lit ass videos, all motherfucking summer, man. I'm not playing with y'all. It's coming. It's not gonna stop, okay? Join the fucking lit ass team on the tube. The litest, mo- most ignorant team on the tube. Join us, nigga. See y'all next video. Bye. They praying on my downfall, cause I'm popping. I can get any bitch I want, I got options. I don't trust the soul, niggas. Be on the opposite. Run up on me wrong, nigga. Get hit with that chop